Okay, it's a quick tutorial on how I use Zen. I've already, I presume you can enable modules, and um, I've enabled the um, Xenophobe, which is uh, here on Drupal.org. Let me show you URL. There you go. Um, and obviously, Zen. Zen is such a great module, it has all these awesome features like. Um, HTML5, responsive, mobile first, and you can use the um, Sasa, I don't know how to pronounce it, but you know, it makes CSS a little bit more fun. Um, there's a list of all, all of, some of its awesome features here, probably most of its awesome features there. No, no, it doesn't mention the fact that it's pretty blank. That's probably mentioned up here. <laughs> It's a starter thing, so it's it's you know takes what we put in, adds these awesome features, and hey presto, we got a website! Yay! Hopefully, it's going to be that simple, right? So let's create a um, the starter theme system name. Let's just call it BF. And you, all right, let's actually call it Bike Fix. I think I've created one of these. Yeah. Um, something then. And this is um, from 5.1. So I'm going to put that in just so that there is a version 3 which is still used by some sites. So wait, I'll leave it in the sites all folder so it's available to, to uh, my. Um, test site as well. Um, I'm not totally sure what we're going to have, so I'm just going to leave it on fix for now. But we can change that, it's not a hard thing to do. And um, sidebars 200 and they're responsive, so it seems about right. So I'll get it to make a, a Override sidebar stuff, and we don't need a fresh style sheet because we're just going to edit the style sheets that it's got. And there we have it, we have a new style of theme. Ah. Okay, so 3.1 is currently installed. Let's hope it works with um, five. So. I mean, it has for me in the past, so anyway, we'll see if there's a little problems, we'll have to go back to Zen and read through the documentation. There's quite an extensive amount of documentation in here. So let's um, put all that to refer to if we need it. So here we are with our new theme freshly installed for our shop. Oh, let's see if I do want appearance. So this is the uh, Kickstarter theme, which I think is great, as it just um, it's got some awesome features as well. But obviously, it's got a load of stuff, a load of legacy stuff that you'd have to overwrite if you wanted to use it properly. Excuse me, cat. Here's our new theme. Enable it and set it as default. So this is how our, our um, theme looked with its with its nice already done shopping thing. And um, let's reload the page. Brace yourself. <laughs> it's going to be pretty blank. There we are. So we still have some of our stuff, like the, um, but obviously it's all completely unstyled now. Um, but things still should still work. That's why you search for a bike. So 
do we have 92 mentions of bike, 3 mentions of bike fix, 1 mention of bike err. Lots of bike whiz, let's try that. Uh, right, so this is how our search result page looks. And if we drill down and say, right, I only want fitness, and then I just get the one fitness, which is the yoga for cyclists. Right, so you can see that's that's the site without any. I don't know whether this slide show them. Um, yep, yeah, slide show still works. That's good. Great, so now we get down to the style sheets as I was saying. Now a really good thing to have is Firebug. If you've got Firefox, if you haven't got Firefox, use Firefox, get Firebug. Um, and then you'll get this nice um, way of editing and seeing the style sheets. Um, yeah. So you can see the, the code that's used here. And oh yes, and it said it had responsive layout, so let's test that. Um, here's our markup. Does it suddenly change? No, not really. <laughs> so yeah, I might we might need to look through the, the instructions. So I just found out that um, here it's not compatible and we should really just use Drush to to um, enable the themes. But I had a quick go at it and it seemed to like it. So maybe I need to disable Xenophobe. Okay, so there we go, successfully disabled. Now, can I run Zen? Okay. I'm just going to get a list of what. Yeah, there's. Then create a new sub game. Obviously, we have to have that enabled on our site, so let's make sure it's enabled. Okay, it says it's enabled. I'm just going to do that again, make sure it actually is. I should say it's already enabled. Oh, it did in the first place, so it's already enabled, so it's all okay. So, I'll try and put in, oh. Hmm, the graphic mod. Uh. I've obviously got problems. I'll come back to it later. <laughs> Or just go through it manually. Yeah, maybe I'll go through it manually and create a new Zen sub, sub game. Um, that's a shame. That's
doesn't seem to like the Zen. Um, that, I don't, don't know what's going on there. Anyone's got any ideas, give me a shout, it'd be great. 